people. I have some tea here actually. I've got it from church. Our churches are different. We're given tea if you're visitors. Today I decided to come to church. <laughs> Say thank you to God for life and just be grateful for the small things that it gives you, you know. So to me I'm the church and then we're going to go to the next stop. Today I have to do the one here. Keep you guys updated as I go with chats. See you. Alright. Where are you? 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 Where I know the OG, but if you ask them, uh, let me help. Let thank me help. you. What are you for? K. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you just walking like this. Guys, this has been a very fulfilling trip. I'm very happy. Yeah, I'm a little bit of 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 a but yeah, we'll try to get to the airport so I can tell you guys what's going on next. Okay? Alright. Tell him you want to use expressway. Mkiwa apa in case akata yu wa ujue. Guys, on this mini tour, I'll just show you some of the buildings in town. So, like I've shown you before, I've showed you the parliament. And then if you can see the cylindrical building, that's the famous KICC, which is the Kenya International Conference Center. Everyone who tours Nairobi usually goes there to take pictures at the, at the rooftop because it's pretty high. So just some facts about the expressway it was built during i believe during COVID time and it was under the regime of our previous president who kenyatta so this is part of the chinese project that was happening in kenya and they do have the toll system only that for us because it's the first time we're having toll systems in the country people are a bit adamant to it for you to use this road you have to pay 300 kenyan shillings um, of which that would I don't, I don't know if it would make sense for someone to use that to pay to use this road if you're economically challenged or would you rather use that for food so that's why you can say this road is pre pretty clear like there's no traffic at all because very few people can af actually afford to use it um, the reason why I wanted to also use it was apart from the experience side of it because it seems like I'm a tourist in my own country is also to get to the airport faster because initially I, that I thought my flight was at one o'clock and when we were leaving church it was around 10 10 o'clock and i didn't want to be i didn't want to miss my flight especially because 
every single time i've been at the airport there's just been so many so much queues and also you can also watch this video up here once you're done with this one to see the challenges i faced when i was going home from johannesburg to nairobi it's pretty fast on this road because i believe it took us at least 10 minutes if i'm not wrong to get from where we were to the airport of which on a normal day if i was using the normal road it will take me maybe like an hour an hour and a half if there's traffic or even sometimes two hours like i've been mentioning all in all all the other videos nairobi and traffic is like best friends same waterproof for real <laughs> How weird is it that the person who actually was driving me to the airport on this day is from Mombasa where I was going. <laughs> this life is so crazy. That was fast. That was very fast. That was like 10 minutes. 5 minutes. JKI. JKI. Baby. I didn't passport. So here yeah, the driver is just telling us that we're going to have to alight the car at the entrance of the airport and go through a security check and then get on back onto the car on the, after we've gone through the security check. But I think it started when um, the Al-Shabaab bombing attacks happened in Kenya. So just for security's sake, um, yeah, this is what we do. <laughs> Just for information, there's actually a couple of flights that usually leave um, per day from Nairobi to Mombasa, and then also different companies. I was going to use Kenya Airways, but there's also Jumbo Jet, and Musa was actually informing me that it's better to fly with the morning flights, but that wouldn't have worked in my favor because at the hotel that we were going to stay, the check-in was only from 2 p.m., so it made actual sense for me to take the plane for 3 p.m., so everything will just flow as supposed to in terms of the transportation from Mombasa to Diani because it's a whole other drive that you'll see if you continue watching the video. Yes, yes, I did. Up to next door. Yeah, I'm going to corner. Huh? <laughs> I'm <top> left. <laughs> short left, short left, and I'm there. <laughs> And still on the flight, if you're someone who's flying from outside the country and you don't have any plans of passing through any other parts of the country, it is much cheaper if you fly, say, for example, from Johannesburg to Mombasa Strait than it is to fly from Johannesburg to Nairobi and then land in and then go to Mombasa. Like, I don't know how that happens, but there's just more airfare when you fly from anywhere and this is something i also noticed in another video that i did which is up here you can just watch it that if you fly straight into nairobi the flights are more expensive if you fly from to into another part of of kenya <laughs> 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 So apparently we were, I arrived at the airport a little too early and Musa was like, oh, I'm going to stay at the airport and grow a beard. But luckily enough, I had things to do. So like editing the YouTube videos that I needed to upload as well as do some work uh, from the engineering side of my life. So another faster way of getting from Nairobi to Mombasa is using the SGR, which is our train system. But because I didn't get the chance to experience it again, I would just like you guys to hear the story from my sister's perspective. They did construct it well. Yeah. That one, the economy is cramped. Okay. Cramped, cramped, cramped. But like, uh, it's not that, that you're the only ones who made the, the, the trains. Yeah. There were people. Why did you put the economy looking like that? It Even looks if like someone is paying 1,000 shillings, surely. <laughs> <laughs> surely. 
Sasa si you just put like 3k alafu wewe unalipa. The 3k doesn't make sense for me. For, for the for the thing the, the, what you call it the other coach. You see if it was 3k like, then I'm taking like 1 hour to yeah. get to Mombasa yeah. because it's possible. Yeah. 2 hours. Yeah. It's another 5, five hours. hours. Is it Why? not 4 hours? No, you are not the first people to make a train. <laughs> it's not who are doing discovery. <laughs> are not doing discovery. <laughs> Please. Bana, <laughs> you want to chase there? Mulipangwa. Mulipangwa. That one. That one for free. I'll tell. I'll tell even the 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 the, the, the president. Kwa nani? The former. You did us wrong. You did us dirty. <laughs> It wasn't bad that it caught the airport early because it gave me some more time to bond with my sisters. Guys, all this was doing poses with my bags. Can I tell you Why is this super? No, this one. And then you, which one is yours? No, this one is mine. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. And then Mama, Why which one is so yours? heavy? <laughs> <laughs> what have you got? <laughs> it can't be the socks. <laughs> At this point, we were just taking pictures and chatting, and this guy is busy wanting me to take photos of them using my bags as if they're the ones who are leaving. It was just fun. It was a very intimate moment that I actually treasure, and I'm happy that I got the opportunity to head over to the airport with them. <laughs> They are both out. Yeah. Am I saying yeah. goodbye? Yeah, yeah. I don't want like, to. You don't want to, baby. <laughs> you don't want to, baby. <laughs> I don't want to say goodbye. <laughs> Where? But then just say my dad. This is my big sister. Uh, you see, you see how sexy she looks. baby, wa Kenya. Ora, be a kangapi, mama. Mimi. I don't say man girl. Ema poli poli. Ah! Ha 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 I'm a, I'm a 2K. Uh, imagine, imagine. And this is our adopted sister, Marissa. Do you want to you say your age, no? Guy. Are you guy? No, 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 no. But I look, I look, I look like I'm 28. Exactly, I mean. Uh, and then you add a few years on top of that. <laughs> we don't want to know how much. <laughs> ah, thank you. <laughs> Yeah. I know, I know it doesn't have to be mm, enough. This right? face should be on the billboard. Don't you think so? <laughs> Your voice, even. Even my voice. Yes, ma'am. Ah. Right? <laughs> voice over. Cast me, cast me. I'm ready to come to SA. Uh -huh. Yeah, because it's like I'm not being appreciated. You know? <laughs> My chicks are even hurting me. I don't even want to lie. Woo! Anyway, this is goodbye. I'm gonna go by five for my sisters until Bye. next year. I love them too, Mama. This one's up my heart. If you see my heart, you see this ones. This ones. Now, Penda. We love you. Love you guys. Thank you. Subscribe.
Leave, eh? comment, leave a like. Comment. Uh -huh. Leave a like. Put a thumbs up uh -huh. and share. Oh, With you guys, do you share? Peace. Oh. <laughs> we need to do better. <laughs> we are going to do better. Please, friend, do better. Yeah, we'll do better. Get those subscriptions. Yes. Mm -hmm. All right? Yes. Uh huh. Please show some love. Eh? To get a thousand very soon. Up on here. Yes. So if you're my colleague, my friend, I come requesting for your phone. Kindly give it to me. <laughs> I'll just go to YouTube, search Akura Closer Trade. Yeah. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notification bell. Uh -huh. And make sure you watch those videos. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, guys. I think I'll do this video in two feet. I know it'll be too much. <laughs> Okay, sit up and 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 up and